Shalom and welcome to Mishnah Torah. This year is entitled "Uprooting a Kedushin in a Bad Marriage." The Dafyomi Kafyud Amid Aleph talks about Afkinu Rabbanan Kedushin when they uprooted the Kedushin. It's a massive topic, and we cannot apply anything to the two minutes of Torah. It's uh, gone on for centuries. Rabbis trying to deal with a marriage that's gone wrong, and uh, Basin said to the husband to give a get. He's not giving a get. So some rabbis say, maybe we can uproot it. It's a massive topic, which is one interesting toast. This is part of the major discussion in Kufiud Abed Alif. The toast says, in our daf, Kufiud, when it's talking about uprooting a marriage, what is it based on? Tosus gives two possibilities. Is it called Rabbanan? that when we have Kedushin, it's with the Das of the Rabbanan, that they approve of what we are doing. And that's why we say, And we talk about the Kedushin is the Das Chachamim. And that's why in the Kuf Yudas talks about maybe the possibility of uprooting it, because the whole thing was done al Tanai, that it's in line with the Das Moshe of Israel. Or uh, Tosha says, wait, but the Gemara doesn't say th- that idea here. So maybe there's a separate halacha that Rabbana can absolutely uproot a bad Kedushin. Tosha just leaves it as a question. Of course, as I said, this is a massive topic, and many rabbis have dealt with this over the centuries to fight, fight, figure how do you deal with this when he's not giving the get? And some tried this uprooting Kedushin approach. It's not simple in any way whatsoever, but there's an interesting Tosfos and Kufiud Amad Aleph that has these two different approaches. Shalom.